Good morning. Today we are starting off our day here with conditions that are not too bad. I've got our DOT cam along the I-94 corridor on the Red River Bridge shown here. And you can see the road looking okay. A little bit of sheen on the road. Of course, we know we've got that treatment that happens on the bridge. Uh, and there may be some places that need a little bit of chemical on the road because of a little frost out there. Uh, you might be encountering that this morning as you are hitting the road, maybe seeing a little frost on your windshield, especially in areas like in Fargo, where we've had clear skies overnight. That plus uh, the lack of wind can lead to frosty mornings when we're below freezing. Beyond that, though, beautiful weather here today for travel. Once those temperatures climb, we won't have to worry about that so much. And we'll see even some record setting temperatures coming up for uh, this afternoon, potentially in the Southern Valley. Not everybody gets there, uh, but we'll be warm everywhere. And in the Fargo Moorhead area, we have a decent shot at uh, getting into some record temperatures today. So again, looking pretty good. Now there are some areas where we're watching out for some uh, fog. You can see in the Morris area, we've got a visibility report coming in at five miles. War Road, Roseau, Bedette checking in at five. And then some places where we're closer to that three mile range as well. So again, visibility may be a factor, a little bit of fog in the Northern Valley. Rozo was down to a quarter mile visibility uh, not too long ago this morning. Morning. So watching out for that. And again, we are seeing temperatures that are going to be on that milder side today. With wind, that's not much of a problem. We've got calm reports coming in this morning with a lot of places really seeing no wind at all here continuing on into today. So wind is light. That'll be great for those golfers who are heading out to hit the links here today. And then temperatures that are comfortable. Again, this morning you'll need your coats, 30 degrees in Fargo. And in Grand Forks, we're at 30 degrees. And in the Southern Valley, you can see clear skies in the South. You can see Northern Valley. We've got some clouds. We're looking at cloud cover in the North, uh, in Northeastern parts of the viewing area and now pushing into the West. And there is a little precipitation showing with that. Doesn't necessarily mean that we're experiencing uh, any rain or snow underneath those clouds, but it's something to watch for for today. So this will be passing through. So there are gonna be times where we're, we've got sunshine once it's up, of course. Uh, and then times where you see these clouds kind of working their way through as well. This is through late morning and into the nude hour. And here we go into the afternoon, 3 p.m. You can see temperatures that are into the 30s and 40s north to some 40s to some low 50s in the south. We've got uh, some temperatures that will be back into the 30s by the time we head into the evening for us for tonight. So again, conditions that are very warm. And if we do reach that 50 degree mark today in Fargo, it will be a record for today. Now our forecast, it's sponsored by Innovative, Innovative Basement Authority. It just keeps getting worse. The crack keeps growing. The doors and windows stick. This must be very frustrating. Almost no one connects that these are telltale signs that water is shifting your foundation, but it's okay. We got it. Oh, this is done growing in this house. Okay. The effects of water can be surprising, but at Innovative Basement Authority, we'll do a complete home inspection for free. Today we're looking at weather that is going to be on the warm side, getting to 50 degrees in Fargo by Thursday. Still warm, but maybe not a record. We'll be very close uh, to a record high into the 40s with breezy conditions. And then by Friday, we're at 32 degrees, so cooling back a little by the end of the week. And then here's that weekend forecast. You can see temperatures that are into the 50s, and that will continue on into Monday. So uh, maybe some more records being set by the the end of the weekend and then next week we'll be watching out for chances for some preset but no big dips in temperatures I mean actually kind of some big swings but we're so warm that we'll still even be above average even on those cooler days in the forecast who to thunk it yeah here we are <laughs> look at us <laughs> thriving yeah that's right thank you Lisa